Hi, Mark Jones. Sight Sur Hey, Darren. <laughs> Let's do some sight surveys. You have been two years. Great idea. Go out early to the job, mm -hmm. and then you could do sight surveys. It would be, be amazing. It would yes. be phenomenal. Great, great work. <laughs> Thanks, Mark Jones. <laughs> Those are, I need to update. Uh, what? My mental health. What? And my mental health. What do you need? You're just, you like to be unhappy. That's the truth. <laughs> <laughs> Can you put this in the documentary and how miserable right. I am working here? <laughs>
It really is family. We call it Sun Pro Family. Uh, from the founders, we all know each other. We vacation together. Even we've been here for nine years. And sometimes we get on each other's nerves for sure, like family does. But we always work it out. Uh, we hang out with each other. We know each other's children. We know likes, dislikes. It truly is a family atmosphere. Yeah, there's a time to work, and we work really hard. But we also play really hard too. The Sun Pro celebrations are legendary. I really enjoy like pouring into other employees, working with employees. Um, you know, it's very satisfying. You know, I occasionally still get emails from employees like, like, hey, because this company I bought my first house, because this company I, you know, I just bought a new car. I mean, I got an email like two weeks ago from a, a gentleman who, when he started with our company, was homeless, and he sent me a picture of a house. So he's like, I have a house today because of this company. Thank you. You know, for me, like, that's just incredibly, really satisfying. More, much more so than any amount of, you know, profits or, or uh, business success. I never, I never stopped, right? So we, I took a lot of risks. There was multiple times that we had reached a point in our business where I, I could have been very comfortable and and made a really good living and with not a lot of stress. Um, but every time I got to that inflection point, I said, "No, I'm gonna, I'm gonna do it again. We're gonna go bigger. We're gonna go to another state." We're we're going to uh, hire more people. We're going to, you know, we're going to go to a different market. So we begin to look for, uh, go search different paths, whether we be public or maybe a strategic acquisition. And ultimately, uh, through that process, uh, met ADT, and uh, ultimately led to, you know, them 100% acquiring our company in December of 2021 when it became apparent that we were either going to go public or be acquired by a public company, it was really exciting. Huge investment in the company, uh, a lot of pride. You know, we started out a little podunk company and started in Slidell, Louisiana. And good story of a small company who made it big. Really exciting times for us here at the company. You know, I am by my very nature an eternal optimist, but I think as an entrepreneur, like you have to take that approach. Like you have to believe in yourself and believe in your ultimate success. There were times on my journey where even my own wife doubted my sanity for doing what we're doing, you know? And I would tell her, like, I have this vision, if you'll just like stay with me, like stay with this, like in a couple of years, we could be, at the time, we could be the biggest ultimate we did. The reason why SunPro was so successful is the people. You know, starting with our CEO, the fearless Mark Jones, he had a great vision. Uh, he hired people. You know, there's a saying, hire to your weakness. So he hired a lot of key people who have their individual strengths, and he allows us to play to those strengths. So pretty much it's go big or go home with SunPro. You've got an idea, you go out and you make it happen. Yeah, we're going to fail, but we pick each other up, figure out how we make it better, and we just move forward. I love this company. I love to um, I love to grow it. I love to keep building. As long as I can keep building uh, and working with our team, having the opportunity to pour into other employees, uh, you know, I foresee myself doing this for you know, maybe forever.